So what is up guys? Back here with another episode of the fishing pole today. I'm at the lake I was last time doing some fishing with my one friend that can make it today. And today we're going to be doing a challenge because apparently the pan fishing is really good. Today we're going to be trying the ice fishing rod versus regular fishing rod Louis jalapeno fishing challenge. So this is going to be a really interesting, maybe a stupid idea. But hey, we're going to give it a try. We're actually going to be fishing a different section over that way a little bit. Um, yeah, over there a little ways, so hopefully this is going to be fun, or either if I lose, it's going to be really, really, really bad. Okay, so, yeah, I went fishing a couple times on the river and at a pond, didn't really have any luck, a couple of bass, but nothing really worth recording, so let's get right into it. Okay, guys, well, it is freezing and windy again here today. I got unlucky. I couldn't make it yesterday when it was good. The weather, not so windy, and it's freezing out here today. We're in a different part of the lake. We got attacked by some stupid dog. It didn't have a collar, probably some stray. It looked like it. So we made it out of that area as quickly as possible because the freaky dog. And it ran away, luckily. So we're going to start this challenge. I think we're going to do a bit of a point system today. I think it's going to... One point for every bluegill we catch. On my ice fishing rod, that's going to be hard. We've already caught a couple, caught a couple of little gills, but this wind's going to be a pain, so I'm sorry for the audio. It's probably going to be bad today with that wind, but hopefully we get something. And any other species, if we catch anything else, it's going to be worth three points. And at the end of time that we have, because we're not going to be out here much longer, and this thing only has, it didn't charge it before I came, and it only had just a bar of battery left, so I'm not going to have to be careful what I record, because it's not going to have a lot. So hopefully we'll get some fish soon, and so we can actually complete this challenge. And it's going to stink for the loser. Looks like I'm going to have to eat a jalapeno, and those things are pretty darn spicy. Okay, let's get right, right into it, guys. This is my basic little set, just my little ice fishing rod. Shakespeare, cheap stuff. Just this little thing. It's really fun to fight fish. I'll probably be doing a lot of my challenges on this thing. It's fun. Again, I'm using the little, just the bow of the sinker, and that, using that little... I don't know if you can see it. A little red wax worm, tip of the red wax, red jig head, tip of the wax worm, like it was last time, because it's really been working lately. So hopefully we'll catch some more on this thing. Eight minutes on the timer right now. Uh, let's get started in five, four, three, two, go. Okay, Damien, eight minutes. going to be an 8 minute challenge, well 8 or 10 minute, how, however you choose, so that's going to make it a bit more pressure, and well, hopefully I don't lose, but with the wind, this thing is very light, so it does not cast far, so it's really hard to get it out to them. First fish right here for me, uh, just a little baby bluegill. Uh, it's not that big, but it's worth a point in the challenge, so it's one to zero for me. and it felt like a 10 pounder on that tiny little rod. Teeny, teeny little bass. Hey. Oh, hey. Yeah, that counts for three points, so that puts me in the lead. Man, this thing felt huge. Man, it's freezing though. It's so hard to get a good cast out. But first, well, actually, third bass of the year. Definitely the smallest. Okay, buddy, call in your 10 pounder. Yep. 3 to 1, guys. Man, it's 
freezing out here today again. I always pick the worst days for these challenges, I swear. I hope you can at least see a little bit. I got that basket all pretty much broke. Uh, whew, it's cold. Interesting day. I have to make the timer on this challenge a bit longer. The action just, the action just died off all of a sudden. My hands are so cold. I had to put them in the water, wash off the slime from that bass, and now they're freezing. Okay, guys, so we're making the challenge longer now because it's so cold we can't get a cast out. We only caught two little fish. Well, we're trying to, get, try to do better, so we're making it. Yeah, timer half now. So, turn down. That's an awesome fight, but that is just a beautiful sunfish, guys. I can't really get a good look at them. Beautiful sunfish, guys. Ah, okay size. Biggest one yet, but it was a really fun fight in that teeny little thing. You gotta wait for a break in the wind to catch anything, but... So that puts me up 4-1 to one on this challenge so far, so... See you, buddy. It's actually my first sunfish of the year. And bluegill and sunfish are so stinking slimy. Yeah, I felt like no better luck. Gonna have to pick this up and catch some more fish. Damien's still in the lead, but I'm catching up. Man, this ice fishing rod's a pain. A <laughs> normal rod would be so much easier. But somehow I'm still winning. And his line just snapped off, so he has to switch. This is a big chance for me, but it's so windy I can't get this light line out there. Bluegill, sorry, this thing's gonna run out of battery in a minute, so sorry if that happens, but another little bluegill, so that puts it up like five to two now. It's been a really rough day. I think we're gonna have to do a part two of this challenge because the wind's just terrible. You pretty much can't do anything in these conditions. Sorry for the quality and audio, it's gonna be pretty darn bad. Rough, rough fishing day. It's freezing out here, and all this this stuff's covered in sand. Great, that's always fun.
this one because my friend is still tying up. We broke off after that snag. But no little bluegill. I, I'll just keep him tied with two. I think I got to a point. He can't get his line in the water. He keeps getting all tangled up with his normal rod. Uh, I think I'm going to do quite a few of my net challenges in the future of this little thing because it's so much fun to fight these little fish on them. I'm going to do, be doing quite a bit of ice fishing challenges. I definitely recommend it if you want to try it. Challenge at home because it is really, really fun to fight these little things on it. It can be a pain to cast and stuff. and It's light line, but sure is fun to fight fish. If it weren't for this wind. I've got like 15 minutes left. I definitely have to do a part two of this challenge. This day was just in bad direct conditions. We're not catching a ton of fish. It's like impossible to get your line out far enough. And my friend's been in the water for like five minutes in total during the entire time. So it hasn't been the most fair challenge either. Woo! It's freezing. I'll lose you guys any minute now. This thing's just about out of battery. So guys, it is late and, well, the battery ran out as you probably saw. And we... We actually ended up catching quite a few fish after that, which is annoying. We're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm sorry we didn't really get to the interesting part in this, whether, whatever point of view the good part is, uh, eating jalapeno, either the bad part of, in your point of view or the good part. So, I don't know what you guys, but I'm definitely doing a part two to this fish off challenge type thing. I'm definitely gonna be doing a part two to this because the conditions are terrible looking today. Uh, I kind of missed it, but we did. My friend was pretty much tying and fixing his line the entire time that I was fishing, and I got ahead to him, so I'm, I'm going to take like two points away from me. And so we'll continue it in a few days, so stay tuned. That will be coming up. In the next few days, I'll definitely be doing some more challenges, probably going to the river. And I did get some how-to footage at the river last week on like some just some basic rigs for steelhead. I don't know if you guys want to see that. Leave in the comments below if you do want to see some how-to videos or something like that. So yeah, I'll be doing. I'll might be doing a catch and cook thing soon. I'll probably be doing some bass fishing videos soon. Hopefully. So yeah, hopefully that soon. My friend was really angry because the second I ended the challenge, he caught a decent bass and a bunch more bluegill. But it was just so cold that we gave it up. We pretty much ran out of bait. So we spent the rest of the time we were forced to be there behind a garbage can by a restaurant in the freezing cold with nothing to do, all bundled up and wrapped up. So that was a lot of fun, but no, it really wasn't at all. But we did have a pretty okay time fishing, so we're definitely going to continue this challenge. I'm sorry, didn't finish it. The conditions were just not great. So, thanks for watching. Hopefully catch you later very soon.